So you definitely want to start with a light uh, base coat um, with the Rust-Oleum khaki there. And just kind of did a light coat all over. And I'm going to let the, it's kind of cold here in Maine, and I'm going to let the heater kind of help me warm it up a little bit and cure that first layer. Probably let this one sit for an hour before I do the next coat. And then we have a second coat here. You know, that's probably going to be good for that. I'll let this set up for a little while, then I'm going to wrap it with some rope and uh, we'll kind of take a look at things from there. So I wrapped it all up in the rope there. Has some thicker bands. I'm uh, going to spray it down. And then I'm going to do a lighter coat of green and then I'm going to finish up with a dark layer. And whatever you finish with is going to be the most um, prevalent color on the gun. All right, that's the Rust-Oleum Army Green. Now we're going to outline it again with rope. I'm going to get kind of close to these bunches to try to have it so it has a green outline with the kind of a khaki um, line. And the rest where you see green in between is actually going to be sprayed over again with uh, this deep forest green. So the whole gun's going to be quite dark green probably. Well, we'll see. All right, wrapped it up with some more of the rope I was using in the beginning and added some jute to it. Uh, that stuff is a little bit more fibrous, so it kind of gives it a little bit more of a texture. Uh, now I'm going to hit it with that dark green, and uh, we'll let that dry. And then afterwards I might go back in with some of that original uh, flat dark earth, well, I guess they call it khaki, and uh, maybe some oak leaves, give it some texture if it needs it, but we'll take a look at it then. Alright, made all the uh, embellishments and everything I wanted to make on it. Gonna uh, take it in and unwrap it. And here's the final product. Came out pretty good. Not really sure I like what I did down there, but maybe I can touch that up later. But, uh, yeah, where I taped it, you know, some of the stuff on the edges, maybe if I would have cleaned that and done that a little nicer, it would have looked nicer. Maybe next time I will. Not bad.